Hey guys, welcome back. Today it's going to be my April favorites video. This is my second time filming it and I'm so excited about that. I hope this is going to be a great video that you guys will enjoy. I have a ton of favorites. I have like random favorites, beauty favorites, skincare, articles, magazines, whew, TV, you name it, I got it. So grab a cup of coffee, grab something to eat, and let's just get started. I feel like skincare is super important no matter what you're doing, no matter how you're doing it, whatever, you need to have your skincare down. So I've really been into taking care of my skin. Like I've mentioned in the past, and this is the Simple Foaming Cleanser uh, Face Wash. And I think it's really awesome. I started using it this month, and I have not stopped using it. It's very gentle on your skin, and you can use it just about every single day. I actually use this almost twice a day, depending on um, what I'm doing. I just, it feels so refreshing, so nice on the skin. I absolutely love it. And I talked about this in my last month's favorite and if you know it is the simple cleansing micellar water and it is just a gentle cleanser that's going to remove your makeup that's going to remove excess dirt and oils and things like that from your skin and i actually ran out of this the other day and i realized i cannot live without it i literally cannot live without it like i'm obsessed with this simple is just a really good brand if you have sensitive skin and you should definitely definitely give it a try Provise skin type one through six and I actually received this in my boxy charm box a couple of months ago if you guys remember it had been last month or the month before I don't remember but you guys I absolutely love this I do not know how I was doing skincare before this mm. You guys i don't know how i was doing skincare before this but i absolutely love it just making sure that your moisturizer is actually sinking into the skin and staying it when you first put it on it's kind of like smooth and silky and then it gets a little bit tacky that's just going to help protect that moisturizer so it doesn't go anywhere and then also it helps protect your skin from the sun so this is a little bit pricey that's the only thing i hate about this i'm not sure if i would actually repurchase it but while I have it, I'm loving it. Next thing is moving on to kind of like body care items. It is the Johnson Baby Oil Gel. It's in the Shea and Cocoa Butter. This is amazing for dry skin. If, and if you have dry skin like I do, you need this in your life. And I'm going to need dry skin like on your body, not on your face because I'm a Crisco face, but my body is dry. It's so weird. If you like need help moisturizing your skin, definitely give this a try. What I do is just when I get out the shower, I pat my skin just to make sure I'm not wiping off any of the nutrients and moisture that I just put in. And then I apply this and my skin literally feels like baby smooth all day long. I absolutely love it. I usually let it sit on the skin for about 15 to 20 minutes before I put on clothing. That way I don't um, do any, have any like transfer or anything like that. And I only use this at night. The next thing that I want to talk about is the Harvey Prince Hello. And this is, this has been my holy grail since I received this. If you watch my April unboxing of the boxy charm box then you would see that i actually use this and i tried it on and i was in love with it it just smells like a man it smells amazing it smells wonderful i'm not going to sit here and try to explain it to you because you will not understand how amazing this smells until you smell it yourself if you can find a sample somewhere definitely go check it out because it is worth it for sure i on to nails this is actually what i'm wearing on my nails today i wasn't wearing it when i actually filmed this video yesterday but since i had to film it again i was going to paint my nails like i mentioned in that video and i painted my nails this color is paramatic and it's by the simple shine with joltek um collection at walgreens you can pick this up for like a dollar 99 and i just always top it off with the sally hansen hard as nails this combo literally looks like you have a fresh gel manicure love it i have to do my manicure tonight because i'm actually going out of town this weekend for a wedding so when you're seeing this video i will actually be headed to austin for the weekend so yeah has nothing to do with nail polish but i thought you guys should know and tomorrow's my birthday so actually when you're watching this video on may 1st that's my birthday. Happy birthday. Let's move into makeup because that's what we're all here for, right? I have two favorite lip products which are very similar in shade because like I tend to do that a lot because that's just how I roll. The first color is from the um, 
Wet n Wild collection is the new Shine lipsticks, and it's the dark wine color, 536A dark wine, and I really love this color. These are very moisturizing, very long wearing, and if you have not watched my Hot or Not on these, then you definitely need to check it out, and I'll link it below. And then also a shameless advertisement for myself. I have a Hot or Not on these, and it's the Chunky Lip Pencil, and I've been wearing these two colors the entire month of April. The Hot or Not just went up like a couple of weeks ago, but I had to actually test the product out for you guys before I told you if they were hot or not so I actually have been wearing them um this is just that really pretty mauvey brown um muted color that everyone's been loving that's all I have to say I have two mascaras for the month of April and these two are totally different one high-end and one drugstore so there you have two options uh I didn't even mention these in my everyday makeup drawer nope I didn't Sorry. The first one is the Oreo Voluminous Carbon Black. And I did mention this in my everyday makeup drawer. It's just a beautiful, um, easy to apply everyday mascara. If you want those Vroom Vroom lashes, then you really need this. This adds volume and it adds depth to your lashes. And the next one that I want to talk about is the, the Urban Decay Perversion bigger blacker and batter lashes i do have a sample size in this i received it in like a sample box from sephora if you haven't tried one of those you really seriously need to try it it gives you an opportunity to try out several mascaras and you get a full size one for free so that's a really awesome deal um but anyways i when i first tried this i didn't like it and then i pulled it back out a couple of weeks ago and i was on yeah definitely check that one out it is very lengthening if you need help with like curling your lashes upwards and you want them longer definitely check this mascara out something that is so much love that it is broken in my collection and it is the mellow wine wet and wild blush and i can't open it because like i said it's broke i know i can do that whole pinterest thing but i really don't have time for that it's just a beautiful color that you can throw on your uh your lips <laughs> word vomit that you can throw on your cheeks every day and simple it's easy it's not too much it doesn't have any shimmer in it it's matte all that about it and it's under two dollars at the drugstore that would be four dollars olivia it's under two dollars now that the sun wants to disappear again let's talk about panther it is a single eyeshadow about wet and wild i've used this every single day in the um outer v of my eye i was about to say something it totally not that um and then i also use it underneath my eye to smoke everything out and i've also been using it every once in a while just to test it out on my upper lash line um to see if it'll like deep enough that color just a bit because i like a really really dark liner so awesome and it's 99 cents at the drugstore the ofra mineral powder and it's like this really shimmery color it's basically a highlighter and i'm actually wearing it on my cheeks today i'm not going to open it because i'll make a huge mess if you watch my boxy charm unboxing then you would see that i actually had this one there and it's a beautiful beautiful you put it on and you feel like you're j-lo or beyonce okay i'm taking it too far you guys i hate to say this but this video is in the home stretch it's coming to an end i'm gonna make this really snappy because last time i filmed this i kind of cried the tea is from yogi and it's a detox healthy cleansing formula um i actually have the box still surprisingly because usually i don't have the box because usually i've always almost drink drink it all but this is the detox healthy cleansing formula it's just a really relaxing tea um it does detox your body but you're actually going to need to eat clean eat healthy and change your diet and your lifestyle for it to um for you to have like long-term results and things like that but this is just a really good tea to make you feel good i've been trying to cut out like caffeine and things like that so these shoes in the air by the brand wanted they are my little sandals and i got these last year so i'm not exactly sure where i got them i don't even remember maybe somewhere in houston I don't, little gold detailings and then it has the wrap around the ankle it's like brown and then the gold up here as well i really like them my husband absolutely hates these he hates all jesus sandals as he calls them but I don't care. My next favorite of the month is going to be, hmm, Scandal. <laughs> if you know me, you know that I'm obsessed with Scandal. I absolutely love it. Stars Olivia Pope, and she is absolutely beautiful. She's smart. She is powerful. She is, she's everything I aspire to be, literally. I love her. I love her character. I love her in actual real life, which I'll talk about next. And, I mean, this month's season has been mine. 
I don't know what Shonda Rhimes is doing, but like she's doing it and I can appreciate that a lot. I really like it. If you haven't watched Scandal, you should definitely check it out. It comes on on Thursdays. I think it's coming to the close of the season, but if you have like Netflix or anything like that or Hulu, you can actually catch up on the previous seasons and this season. I'll link everything down below if you guys are interested in checking that out. I actually think there's a promo code that I can actually link below for you guys for Hulu if you're interested and you can check it out and get like a month's free and maybe you can catch up on some Olivia Pope. She's really awesome. Okay. Okay guys, the next favorite is going to be Glamour Magazine and I actually, I, I read Glamour every month because I feel like it's very, very much a woman power, um, strong, this month's cover features Sarah Jessica Parker, Michelle Obama, and Carrie Washington. Um, this article is just so near and dear to my heart because it speaks of things that that I really admire. And it talks about our military men and women, and especially our women, because this is, of course, glamour. And it speaks about how, you know, they are one of the number one victims of post-traumatic distress when they come back from um, war and things like that and deployment because the different things happen to him, them. I'm not saying that men are any different, like men have it better, but I'm just saying like different things happen as far as rape and sexual assault. And we know that those things can happen to either sex, but it just really opens your eyes to things that women have to deal with and the things that they've been through. And there's some women in here that will inspire you and their stories are incredible and I think everyone needs to read it and then it also touches on the subject of homeless veterans that we have in our country and it's so sad to know that there are homeless veterans in our community that we could reach and you know it's like what are we doing in our own communities that we can help and do there's some of the best trained people in, in our country and they come home and they're homeless and they don't have anywhere to live and they don't have any jobs and you know what are we doing to help that I just want to do something on my channel to make sure that we are getting the word out there that there are homeless veterans and each one of us should stand up in our own communities including myself because I do feel guilty for that and just really reach out to those people and make sure that they do know that they're appreciated and they are needed in our country but yeah I'm just gonna end on that note and I won't ruin the uh, interview for you guys you should definitely check it out it's gonna be in this month's glamour the May glamour magazine so definitely go check that out I'll have it linked below and everything or you can probably get a free one or something like that. I'll see if I can find a code. For Don't forget to follow me on all social medias at Olivia Remedies, at Twitter and Instagram. I don't have a Facebook yet for my beauty channel, but if you guys would be interested in that, just let me know. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.